Isn't that pretty? Beautiful, pearlescent cloud of Dominican cigar smoke. Cigar. What a thing to enjoy. Thank you for joining us on this occasion. Two hands in the face audio. We are taking a hard look at the TC Electronics Sub Up Octaving Pedal. And if you've seen any of these videos before, you know that we love TC Electronic products here in this household, this family, this tiny little company that is me and one other guy called Two Hands in a Face Audio. And we're big admirers of TC Electronics and the product they offer. And this particular pedal is no exception to the qualities we usually find that we admire in TC Electronics. For instance, build quality. The thing is a brick, man. It's very, very tiny. It's one of the micro pedals but the construction quality is beyond rugged. It's solid as a rock, beautiful paint job, red and black, and it's got quality controls you can feel when you manipulate them. It's got a good sturdy bypass switch. I mean, the thing is well built, which is absolutely typical of TC Electronics. Now this particular pedal, the shove up, allows you to highlight notes an octave down, from your target note on your instrument are notes an octave up and I will demonstrate that principle right now we've got it set with the lower octave note engaged here's my tone by the way now let's engage our sub up pedal with the lower octave portion engaged that there is an octave lower note. It occurs in the basso ranks, and here it is again. So it's almost a 12-string effect. And as easily as you can dial in that lower note, you can dial it completely out, have a clean sound again, and now you can use the upper register control to dial in the octave higher note. truly almost a 12-string effect because it's giving you what you get on a 12-string acoustic guitar in some fashion, which is the tonic note and then a note an octave higher to kind of give it a three-dimensional quality. In some way, it's kind of pretty, isn't it? really sounds like a 12 string but the beauty of the situation is you can use it to thicken chords you can make the chord go from just kind of a plain Jane and you can use the sub up with the higher note affected now you've got a 12 string electric it's a beautiful thing now, a moment ago, we demonstrated the device with the lower register cranked in, and just now, this very moment, we've demonstrated it with the higher register kicked in. Now, let's kick in both registers and see how thick a chord it gives us. It's almost an organ sound. It's almost a dissonant sound, but... We have very well designed controls here so that we can dial out either amount of octave high or octave low or any point in between clean and the full note. And we can dial both of these way back, have more dry signal and get a more controlled sound. So it really gives you a beautiful sound. If it's something you wanna use at minimal levels, it'll serve the purpose of thickening your sound and giving you a chord structure that sounds like more than one instrument being played at once, which is always cool, always desirable. 
Let's try it after a nice puff of smoke and a good swig here. Mmm. Cold root beer. Cheers, man. And a good cigar. There is nothing better except if that were liquor. So, let's engage our distortion sound. Got a nice thick distortion going there through a tube amp. And we can use this device to give us even more presence in those chords. Great thickness, so I'll, I'll do that pass again. Now with the sub up, both octave high and octave low engaged. Great for recording. You can really, really double up your recording and thicken your chords to the point where it lends a three-dimensionality to it. If you're recording especially your, your electric guitar with two mics, which I always recommend, use a good passive mic and use a good condenser mic. But if you're, you're using two signal paths to record your electric guitar, you're going to get some incredible thickening options using this sub-up pedal. <laughs> high and the octave low controls set at minimal levels. Let's really dial them in while the distortion is hot and see what kind of mess we can make here, man. Let's put this Dagwood sandwich together. All the more overtones to feed back with, my dear. So, let's dial out the octave low control and leave some of the high in and here again in distorted fashion what that's going to give us. sub-up pedal you can get that kind of metallic ringing thing. Really, really nasty sound. There's a lot you can do with this pedal. Experimentation is definitely in order. It's a beautifully made device. The TC Electronic Sub-Up Octaver Pedal I can't encourage you enough to go out and play with one. I could sit here and demonstrate a thousand and one sounds. You probably don't want to hear that. I could burn this cigar all the way down to finger height and still be making new sounds with this pedal. But instead, I'm going to encourage you to go and find one for yourself. PC electronic dealers are not difficult at all to find. They're everywhere. Any major city you happen to be in, you can't walk 10 feet and not trip over a TC electronic dealer. And rightly so. Beautiful product, beautiful pedals. And I really appreciate you tuning in with us tonight. If you liked what you saw and heard, please hit subscribe. We'd love to have you rejoin us for future product reviews. And if you didn't like what you saw and heard, pretend that you did and hit the subscribe anyway. And we are very, very pleased to have you. Good night. Good night.